Hey guys, welcome back. Screen Reaper, another video on Raid Shadows. And today we have got a very good video for you guys. It's going to be Spider 10. I feel like I need to redo this video uh, as quick as possible to get this out there. Um, with the fixes that player and done twice to a double hitter and a triple hitter, which has caused everyone uh, a bit of chaos with. Um, with the spider 10 so i've been doing some testing for a couple of hours um i'm working i don't have a renegade speed tune just yet i am working on that and i'm doing some testing and stuff like that trying to make it free to play as friendly but i will be honest i really need to play with a lot of speed uh on my royal guards so i'm going to show you the team for us quickly and i'm going to go over a few things so we have a Lydia in the shield set. A Lydia in the shield set is a is a must. A bolster set can ju work just as well, maybe even better because you get healing. But the boss is going to take a turn and he will one shot you. So you need to make sure that your royal guards are as tanky as possible. Now we do want um, Kaimar in here as well. So. At the moment, it's 303 speed. You don't need to be that fast, but you do need to be faster than the Royal Guards and Lydia just to make sure that you do a reset. Um, so, I've also done some speed testing with Arbiter. Arbiter has to be faster than 350 speed to make this work, otherwise, your Royal Guards will get slept on when the boss takes his turn. Um, Royal Guards have to be faster than 235 speed. Uh, I've done testing with Royal Guard at 225 and 230, and again, the um, Spider will sleep us. So, my Arbiter is normally at 380 speed. I did test it to drop it as much as possible. I tried at 300 speed, 310, 320, 330. I can only get this work at 350 to be consistent. Uh, obviously, you can try sets like Immunity uh, and stuff like that, but I honestly, don't want to try and make it. So, as you can see here, my Royal Guards don't get slept to just drop my turn meter back. Uh, now, Kai, Kai Ma does boost your turn meter back up for 20, and then you can see the Arbiter is just going to do that and then be one shot. So it's not the fastest of teams but it's consistent um, and you really do need that short set now so um, unfortunately that is something that we have to take into consideration this will be around about 90% consistent because we're using defense down a weekend and that does get resisted if that gets resisted then um, it will uh, um, fail unfortunately so yeah uh, we do want to damage the spiderlings in this as well uh, just to um, get some more damage uh, and stuff like that so uh, on the spider so there's a defense down a weaken boink boink so yeah um, so up to free champion Lydia free champion raw guards accessible the Kaimar is going to screw with a lot of people if I'm honest and I understand the frustration of not having a Kaimar but these are in-game dungeons so that is something that we'll have to take into consideration um, obviously I'm trying to be positive as much as possible I still have a fairly good spider team um, but I also understand people's frustration as well so I'm going to go over the presets quickly uh, the presets are really important so we have our arbiter in uh, increased speed and uh, the attack up first now attack up doesn't matter at all we have the call at on second as well we have Kaima to open up with his poisons and then to reset after and all we want is the royal guards to nuke now I'm using one of my Nightmare Hydra Royal Guards that are speed tuned at 239. 
So that is something we all want to take, on, take into consideration. So my Lydia is nothing special. My Lydia just needs to be faster than the Royal Guards. So obviously she's a plus four. I don't really use her anywhere or anything like that. But it's basically accuracy, HP, HP. And then we've got speed boots, HP chest, HP gloves, uh, speed, HP and speed so all we want is uh, good speed so I've got 241 good accuracy so we want 350 accuracy more and then much shield as possible so as you can see I've got 99,000 HP now I think you'll get away with 70 or 80 and then I have took this as well just for the extra shield now I use Lydia normally to stack shield on top of shield in 3 vs 3 arena so it kind of explains why I have these masteries. Arbiter's masteries are typical arena and all I've gone is just the fastest gear as possible. Bear in mind I have slowed down my Arbiter just to make this video a bit more friendly towards end game players. And as you can see got good speed if that's all I'm worried about it's 350 speed plus. No, um, the sorry, that's the wrong Kaima. You get your correct one. So this is Kaima. It's just arena Kaima, basically a high speed and high accuracy Kaima. Uh, that's why I like my Kaima for arena. I have two. I have a high resistance as well. So again, nothing too special there. I think the royal guards are the ones that we need to take a note of. So. I'm using my nightmare. Um, using my nightmare Hydra uh, War Guard. So these are the stats. Please do not build a relentless one for a spider. It will slow your spider down um, by quite a bit. So that's something to take into consideration. So I do have War Master as well. So um, I think a uh, cycle of violence is definitely really important, uh, especially if you don't have a reset. Uh, the refresh is not needed as well. Again, that's for Hydra. So this is the the high. This is the perfect sp spider build for me. Uh, for spider, at the moment I don't have the gear to go equipping these plus Hydra and stuff like that. So there's the stats at the top for everyone. To kind of copy and then these are my masteries again i think the the masteries on my overall guide was actually better so i would copy both of them uh, again refresh not needed you just want to take a hp ring there uh, for survivability i took this one just because of the speed um so i haven't got to take the the gear from anywhere else so this is the, the ideal build hp ring there so and it is really important to get that correct um, so there we are we have the presets we have everything else um, again it won't be 100% unfortunately um, but at the moment I will I will carry on working uh, with team so the one thing I want to do is get a perfect build without Arbiter or Kaima needed um and see where we can take it from there um so yeah there you are guys i hope you have a great weekend i'm not streaming this weekend unfortunately um but uh, it is what it is due to real life and i'll see everyone next week for them i'm gonna have videos planned all this weekend so keep them on, on my channel and again i apologize on that this might not be the friendliest team going, but again, it's still fairly well. So yeah, enjoy the video and hopefully it helps a lot of people out. And I'll see you all next time. Peace.